Hello and welcome. This is Jit Dolakia and you are watching is Tomorrow News. Rescuers look for missing at dead toll rise in Japan. Rescue workers in Japan continued to search for the missing on Wednesday as the dead toll from one of the worst typhoons to hit the country in decades rose to 74, public broadcaster NHK said. Many people were drowned in the flooding after scores of rivers burst their banks. Public broadcaster NHK said 12 people remained missing and more than 220 were injured after Typhoon Hagibis swept through the country over the weekend. As of Wednesday morning, more than 5,000 people are still in evacuation centers in 13 prefectures, almost a third of them in hard-hit Fukushima prefecture, 269 kilometers north of the capital Tokyo. Across the country, 13,000 homes were flooded during the height of storm while 1,100 were partly destroyed. Throughout the eastern half of the main island of Honshu, 52 rivers flooded. Weather officials in Japan were quoted as saying that many places that flooded received up to 40% of their annual rainfall in just two days. On Wednesday, residents in Fukushima prefecture, which suffered the highest number of casualties, were busy dumping water-damaged furniture and rubbish onto the streets. Many elderly remained in evacuation centers, unable to clean up their homes. In Dade City, not far from the site of the nuclear disaster in 2011, a farmer peeled dump books in the street in front of the house, adding to a mound of rubbish from the neighborhood. He said the water had reached about 2 meters deep in this house when he and his son were rescued by boat and taken to an evacuation center. His wife and grandchildren had stayed with relatives during the storm. The Japanese Prime Minister promised on Tuesday to take action after reports emerged of the two men being denied entry to the shelter in Taito Ward in the capital Tokyo. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news. Jit Dolakia. For more weather updates like this, please subscribe to our channel.